I'm a Dentonite and I'm vegan for environmentalism. Health. Buddhism. Yoga. Because <laughs> that's how I found out about it. Spontaneity. Good energies. At the beginning was for health. When I understood what was going on, it was compassion. Be mindful. Ethics? Yeah. For health. Love. <laughs> yeah. Yay. I like that answer. Oh my god. Can All I right. hug you? Yes, Ooh, I thought we were going to high five. That's the, the best answer, answer I've better. heard. That's the best answer I've heard. Like, okay, I'm walking away. <laughs> in, three, in three minutes, tell me why you became vegan. When I moved to this country, everything, all the food was so cheap, was so reachable, that my husband and I would start eating everything. And I always thought that this really disgusting, sick feeling in my stomach was what full was supposed to feel like. And I started going to college and eating less meat because, and, and more peanut butter because it was cheaper. And then every time I ate meat, I would realize that same thing again, and I became more and more aware of that happening in my body. Um, I had a lot of issues with eating disorders and um, not putting good into my body, so I was giving out bad. He dared me to try it for three months, and I said, fine, you know what, fine, I will. And I went after it, and I self-educated, and I asked questions, and I looked around my community and did some Facebook searches and found some really cool groups around me, and I found out that the food was really good. I didn't have the tools. What I did was go back to college and learn nutrition. When I was learning nutrition, I found out what was happening with the animals and how unfair it was. What were we doing to the environment, animals, and ourselves? I started off doing a lot of culinary and I took a nutrition class and we watched Forks Over Knives and it made me really open up my mind from the health perspective. Like I watched a documentary and I got about halfway through and I was like, yeah, I'm just not gonna watch the rest of this. I'm just gonna go vegan. And then I, I did and now I'm here today as a super awesome rock star. Not really, but I feel really great. So. Started doing my own research and learning about what actually happens in factories and I just remember crying so much but I couldn't stop watching the videos. A lot of people eat with the good intentions. Like, oh, I have good intentions. This is, I didn't kill this animal. I didn't do this. I made that connection between, you know, being compassionate for animals but then also being compassionate about what you eat. I remember being younger actually and kind of like, first putting together like this food on my plate was an animal and I remember asking my parents like why do we do that is it weird and they were kind of just like why are you questioning it this is you know what we do. Just going through my entire life being socialized one way and then finding that a way that's better for me and better for a lot of people is still very taboo and shrouded in mystery. You know meeting people and, and creating friendships that uh, you know with people that were vegan. And so that really, that really kind of opened my eyes to, to make it seem like a real thing. I've stuck with, with it for the past four years and it's done nothing but benefit my, my health, uh, my friendship circles, and those are two very important things to me. Putting good energy into my body was giving good out and it really helped me uh, realize that eating was more than just me. It's a part of something I want to share with others and I love cooking for people and I love um, baking vegan things and having people eat them and not know it's actually vegan and then surprising them. I love being vegan. It's awesome and the food is delicious. I went vegan because I thought it would be fun. Like in all actuality, I was like, this will be fun. But I stayed vegan because animals and environment and my health and that's it. Thank you, love. You're welcome.